morning and what a beautiful morning it's turning out to be welcome to the day one of the 2022 Scottish Tour of Scotland including the NC500 it's uh, a beautiful Monday morning, the 1st of August and uh, we're uh, 94.3 miles into the journey and we're just about to uh, do our first stop at uh, Charnock Richard Services to uh, put a toilet break and then we'll, uh, we'll be heading off up into the um, Forest of Bowling. Yeah, so we uh, we left uh, Asda in Albury about uh, quarter to nine this morning. Uh, so it's Kev, me, Paul and Bry. Uh, we've had a nice steady uh, ride up the M6 so far. Not caused us any, uh, any problems with traffic, so we're making good time. It's uh, 11 minutes past 10 at the moment and it's got a lovely, very mild 18 degrees. Uh, air temperature. Uh, yeah, so uh, this is the, uh, the, f the first day. Our destination at the end of the day will be Hull Whistle. Uh, but en route to uh, get to Hull Whistle, we're going to be stopping off in uh, Sedba or Se Sedba or Sedba, however you pronounce it. Apologies for mispronouncing. Uh, we should be stopping off in there, but hopefully having some lunch in Sedba. Uh, before we then take the final sort of uh, leg of the journey for today up to Hall Whistle. So, uh, I say we've, uh, we've, the, we've been blessed with the weather so far, it's really nice, really nice and uh, fingers crossed that it holds out and we can, uh, we can keep the weather for the, uh, for the rest of the week please. So yeah, in a couple of miles now we'll be, uh, we'll be pulling into uh, to Charnock Richards which tends to be our service station of choice when we're heading up, uh, we're up north it's sort of uh, about a hundred miles from home and it's uh, sort of the ideal place to have a wee, have a drink if anybody's hungry to have a bite to eat and it's, uh, it's a, an ideal sort of uh, stopping point when we have to use the M6 which unfortunately for the uh, to get us sort of out of the uh, Midlands and up into the to the nicer parts of the country we have to buy the bullet and, uh, and accept that we've got to do 100 miles or so on the uh, on the motorway so yeah so we're all packed all ready to go i've got the uh, the top box of my two panniers on the uh, on the tracer line and uh, again i filled them up i don't know why i constantly overpack but i do uh, keep thinking I'm going to not do it, but I just think, ah, oh, I might need it, might need it, might need it, so I'll put it in, in the, uh, uh, hopefully in the, uh, uh, and then I take it back with use, that's the plan, but at least I've got it, gives me a bit of peace of mind. So as I say, we're just, uh, just dropping into the services shortly. Uh, once we've dropped into the services, I think we've got another short spell of motorway to do takes up to about junction 34 where we come off I'm not quite sure and another little stretch of motorway and then uh, I shall be uh, rejoining you as we start to see some uh, rather pleasant countryside and uh, yeah I'm just really hoping this uh, this weather sticks like this for the rest of the day because that will make it absolutely sublime ah, here we go Because a week ago today, I was up here uh, heading up to uh, to my dad's funeral. So uh, I'm tending to be a bit of a, uh, a regular in this service station on a weekly basis at the moment. Uh, let's find somewhere to park. Let's have a look down there. Come on, come on, come on. Space is here for us. Wonderful. There we are.
Oh, right. yeah. <laughs> well, we're off the motorway now, and we're uh, we're heading towards in the general direction of Clitheroe. I'm probably going to dump in here and let Brian get some petrol. Well, welcome back. Our, uh, a little bit of motorway work is uh, is now complete. Uh, we're on, we're, we're fully off the motorway, and we're heading up uh, in the general direction of Clitheroe at the moment. Uh, you may hear some other voices, parts of the video. So I've got the uh, got the boys connected up. Well, two of the boys connect Paul and Kev on the chain app at the moment. So we'll see how that goes today. And uh, hopefully, you'll hear some. Uh, uh, interesting conversations, let's put it that way. So, it's, uh, the rest, the next part of the journey takes us, as I say, up to, up to Sed, Sedba, Sedbra. Uh, somebody please tell me how you pronounce it properly. So, uh, that's the general direction we're heading at the moment. So hopefully we'll be seeing some very nice countryside shortly. So hopefully I'll be back uh, with you again. For further updates as we head into the uh, into the Yorkshire Dales and the, the uh, Forest of Bowden. Uh, catch you again shortly. Try to find some new roads that we ain't done before this time. Still there, Paul? Yes, give me your mic. Cool. I'll worry when you're quiet. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I get anxiety when, when I come out of here. <laughs> Getting close to hearing problems there, the 60 nearly. <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm 50, 58 in five weeks' time. Oh, you haven't got away yet. Yeah, you got a couple of years yet, Dave. Yeah. North Yorkshire? North Yorkshire. Aye. Yeah, North Yorkshire. Whippets and flat cap country. Hello, <laughs> Kev! Hey there, Kev. He's fucking gone again, eh? He's gone again. Oh. Lost him again. Gone again, Jeff. They could probably hear us, you know. Probably listening to us. Yeah, no, you're the fucking wanker, Jeff. Jeff, you bloody tarted! The Yorkshire Dales. Yorkshire Dales, Emmerdale Farm, I believe. Go down to Right, where's he's taking me now? That's it, he's taking me left. 
We've been here before, have we, Dave? Uh, we might have been. We might have been. Now. I don't I'm, know. I'm thinking of the white door this year, eh? Yeah, it all looks a, a lot of it similar, in it? See, Slaveburn, we've been there. Indicators on, Dave. Indicator on, Dave. Okay, mate. Oh. So we're in Long Preston at the moment. Left. Very nice, very nice little village, or town. What's the difference between a town and a village? I don't know. We've lowered it. We've lowered the town just by being here. Bloody gorgeous, gorgeous. Lovely jubbly. Lovely jubbly. Hey. Where are you going to now, Dave? You say? Uh, Sedba, Sed, Sedba, or whatever it's called. Yeah, yeah. And then we'll have, uh, hopefully, we'll have fish and chips there, or uh, something. Oh, nice. That'd be nice. That will. And then we've uh, probably about an hour and a half, two hours then to the digs. Yeah. Right, so we're going straight onto this island. Okay. A nice bit of road. No blight. No blight. I like these sort of roads. Yeah, I like these. Twisty. Better than the main drags. Oh, this is bloody lovely. Casterton. It was lovely till we found a fucking car and somebody who's going to pull out on us. Jesus oh! Christ. You can see she shouldn't be on the road, can't you? No! Six point three miles now. Three miles. 
Dogs, 6.3 miles. Ooh. Lovely, lovely, lovely! <laughs> what a view! Little tip. Glorious. All Sweepy road. Oh, this is lovely. This is bloody lovely through the trees here, through the forest. Oh, I've spoiled all what you could have seen. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Over the bridge. Oops, stay fucking there, car. That's it, good, aren't you? Watch it, there's a car on this bridge. Whether he don't know you're coming and he pulls out, I don't know. Ah, I think you're alright, he's waiting. Yeah, he's waiting. Cool. Got a tractor up ahead, a bloody tractor. 
And it's a shit knocker. Uh, blood tracker. I need a blood tracker out of the way. See if I can get past him. Ah, oh, we're all right. We can get past. Him. Plenty of room. Plenty of room. Oh, that's it. Plenty of room. Lovely road. Ooh, -hoo. twisty. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody brilliant. Slow down boys, there's a uh, bumper truck in front. Bump. I'll let you catch up. I can see you all. I'll see what I can get past. Bump. Bump. Digger, digger, digger. There's a bend in front so I'll hold back. Good to go. Well, I am. I can't tell so if it's clear. Still clear. Still clear. Still clear. Still clear. Cool. Everybody through. All through. All through. Right. So let's find the car park. I should have a car park plugged in here, hopefully, fingers crossed, said for school, that looks like a posh school. No point, two miles, just lane. What are you doing? Ah, oh, let the car through. I'll let you off. Nice little town. One mile just lane. So I think we're going up here. We are going up here. And if I'm correct, there should be a car park here. And there is. That's it. Oh, the boy done good. The boy done good again. Where shall we park? Park it anywhere. Uh. Uh. 
Welcome to Sedba. <laughs>